In this video, we're going to be making this butter cake, which is rich, fluffy, and delicious. These are all the ingredients you're going to need to make the butter cakes. Now, I made two cake loaves in this, but you can just halve the recipe and make only one cake pan. So first to your flour, you're going to add in the baking powder and mix that until it's uniformly mixed in. And then to the eggs, add in the vanilla extract and mix that in as well. In a mixing bowl, add the butter and the sugar. Then mix it gently with a spatula and then beat it with a hand mixer or with a whisk for 3-4 to four minutes till it's creamy and fluffy. Then add in one third of the egg and beat that in. Beat it for a minute. Then add in half of the egg mixture and again repeat. Add the remaining egg and beat again on medium speed for about 3 to 4 minutes. Now you're going to sift the flour into the batter. I like to use this step so that the batter is lump free but you can skip it and directly add the flour if you want to. And then you're going to gently fold this using a spatula. When the flour is nearly mixed in, add in the milk. And continue gently folding until your batter comes together and is nice and creamy. That's exactly how your batter should look like. Then pour this batter into your prepared pan and smooth it out. I divided the batter evenly among the two pans. And then bake this in a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 25 to 30 minutes or till the toothpick inserted in the center comes out clean. Make sure to check at 25 minutes so that it does not overbake. Also keep in mind that the time can depend on your oven. And here my cake is golden brown and ready. I let it cool a bit and then you can slice it and take it out of the pan. Cut it into as big or small slices as you want to and enjoy it. As you can see the texture of the cake here, it's moist, fluffy and absolutely a dream. It melts in your mouth and tastes really rich just like a butter cake should. I really hope you tried this recipe out and subscribe for more recipes and I will see you soon. Bye!